This is Couples Court with the Cutlers. This is the case of Lewis versus Weiss. You all have been together for five years. You're engaged. And Ms. Lewis, you've been married twice before, but whether you take that trip down the aisle a third time all depends on the outcome of today's proceeding. That's is that right. right? That's right. All right. You've initiated this case. Tell us why. Well, I'm too old for the cheating. All I'm asking for is honesty. And like I always say, the same way you got this woman is the same way you got to keep her. Do the same thing. <laughs> and we used to have some fun. So you believe that he's cheating. What does that feel like to you? What, how does that affect you? It hurts. Okay. Because Tell me about I that. try to do everything for this man. Show him how much I love him. Okay. I get up five o'clock in the morning. Whoa. And how many women gonna get up, fix their man, coffee, <clears throat> breakfast, and lunch? Plus, I have to go to work myself. <laughs> Woo! Well, you got me beat. <laughs> <laughs> so, I'm gonna just say, Miss Lewis, Lewis, Lewis I, I ain't doing that. <laughs> I know that's what everybody tell me, but I do it because I love him. And I want to show are... him how much I love him and what I would do to keep him, but I'm not going to keep doing it if he's not going to be faithful. I understand. Mm. Well, Mr. Weiss, she says she's too old for this. What do you have to say about it? I'm too old for it. I mean, because when I'm at a friend's house, uh, she peeping around the bush, and they said, there go your old lady. I, I said, I, I know she was coming, but... Uh, and then, so is like, he following you around like a detective or something? All the time. I, I'm just tired of it. It's like I'm in prison in my own house and... Do right. You know, I have to feel like that. See, that's why I had to put up with Ms. it. Ms. Lewis, are you treating him like a prisoner in his own home? No. He feels well, that one, way. one, he'll tell me he's gonna do this, he's gonna do that. And first of all, if he never cheated <clears throat> and lied about it, everything will be okay. I've been married twice. I got eight kids oh, by boy. four different baby mama. What's new out there to me? And like you said, I mean, you've been out there, you've been there, done that. This is the woman for yes. you. Yes, yes. That's all I do. I work, I come home, I call her on my break. I mean, she want me to call her on my first break, second break, lunch break, my food in the microwave. I don't need to get time <laughs> to eat because she want to talk. Not only can you not get a break at work, you can't get a break from not calling her. That's right. So if I'm hearing you correctly, you may have done some stuff in the past, but as it relates to your relationship right now with Miss Lewis, you said you're not cheating, you're not, not cheating. cheating anybody else? No, and mostly all I do is fish. And she know where I fish at, because she take me there. And I, I'm on the phone more than, more than I'm fishing. You know how older guys do, I, I mean, I'm 51. Uh, That's older? Well, uh, 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 he's still young. <laughs> Yeah, Mr. Color, you older. <laughs> oh, I'm gonna just put it out there. Yeah. I thought it was gonna pop up maybe like, you know, 70, 75. He's like, you know how older guys are, you know. I'm <laughs> Wait a minute, he older than you, so you know. So Wait, what does what? that make me? My husband. <laughs> good answer, good recovery, good recovery. So here's the thing. But, but, yeah, hold on, love. I, you know, y'all are kind of cute to me. Really? I'm looking at this look at her face. Yeah, y'all like, kind of cute. She got me, hands so I, on the hip. I mean, yeah, I mean, she tight about this, but I know you said he did something to get you and you want him to go back to doing it. Tell me how you two met. I saw him on Facebook. I looked at his picture. Uh -huh. But what I did, I texted in there, talked about the fish. But the whole time, he wanted the fish I was checking out. <laughs> you were that. trying to reel something else in. Yeah. Okay, you can I call me a cougar because I am 12 years older than him. But... What? Uh oh. But. <laughs> you don't look nothing older than him. Go, girl. <laughs> Keep using whatever you're doing. Thank you. All right. And I liked what I saw. Uh -huh. And we had a lot in common. And when I text him, I was like, is this man going to even text me back? Right. So I waited a week, I did it again. So he finally messaged me, and we used to talk on the messenger. Then we started talking to each other, and it was amazing. <laughs> I was really, smiling. truly Look, I know. I mean, the big that. grin. Yeah. I mean, both of them grin, and I like it. I'm like, OK, <laughs> tell me about this. You get this message from this cute babe. So what happened? OK, it, it took a minute for me to 
uh, actually respond back because, you know, I want to make sure this was something I wanted to do. Right. But I told her I was not driving a car, I was driving a scooter. But that was all right with me. So I'm riding 25 miles. On a scooter? On a scooter and had to go to work just to come visit her. And we ate breakfast, we talked, and by the time I had to ride another 24 miles back to my job. Right. Running late, but... But wasn't it worth it? It, it was way <laughs> worth it. Uh, <laughs> but, uh, so you driving on a scooter? Yes. Girl, what you put in the bags? I don't know. <laughs> but I had to find out again what I put in them, because um, I'm you not need getting to get that same track. treatment again. All right, all right. So now, you yes. think he's fishing for other women, basically. Yes. He, he in another lake, and it ain't yours. There you go. All right. So, Ms. Lewis, it sounds like if you're following him, it seems like everywhere he goes, and, you know, he's always having to check in by phone with you, it doesn't seem like he even has time to cheat. So why do you think he's cheating? He talks in his sleep. Oh. <laughs> okay, yes, he does. What do you, what do you mean he talks in his sleep? Well, I'm thinking, you know, okay, he's asleep. I'm watch, laying in the bed, watch a little TV. I hear him talking about, oh, I can't catch the, the female name. Then he's talking about, I can't talk right now. She here. Yo, then he'll go back to... Okay, wait a minute. Then he'll be like, ooh, fat booty. Oh. This is... Yo, this is okay, stuff... Wait, hold, hold wait on, a minute, hold, hold on. on. Hold on. I, and I, I know wait, he ain't I, talking about me. Okay, so wait a minute. Let me go back. You in bed, he's in bed. Mm-hmm. Clearly, you awake, mm -hmm. and he sleep. Yes, Your Honor. All right, go to sleep, so, fella. So, oh, wait so, a minute, let me see. <laughs> let me see. Let me see how this is. Go to sleep. And so you sit and watch TV. Oh, uh, big booty. And you just kind of look at him? And I be ready. By the time I grab my phone to record it, I mess up and wake him up. So you can't get a, can't get a recording of what he's saying. Right. But you... But, you, but, you but should... I'm listening, and I can hear it very clearly. It happens regularly? It's happened a couple Your, of times. I am sleep. All right. <laughs> so this has happened more than once. Yes. And okay. you think these are conversations, he's rehashing conversations he's actually had with them? Yes. And when you say had with them, he's being with these women while he's with if you. he's not, I'm gonna be honest with you, you don't have to be physically with that woman to be cheating. Uh -huh. You could be on that phone talking to her. Right. And that's still disrespectful. That's still cheating. I don't do it, and I don't expect for him to do it to me. Well, Mr. Weiss, whose big booty are you dreaming about? That's what I'm wondering. You're wondering too. You're wondering to sleep. I gotta ask you, Ms. Lewis, have you ever seen or found anything that makes you think mm. Mr. Weiss is cheating? Mm. Yes, yes, yes. Tell me about that. Oh, my goodness. You know how you have mirrors on your phone? Yeah. And you can put it on the TV? Yes. I'm in there cooking this man something to eat. Okay. I come out the room, he's snoring. I'm like, I'm gonna wake him up. I turn around and look at the TV. You know, I had a little picture in the corner. Yeah. I'm like, who is that? I'm like, oh, no, he didn't. <laughs> I go over to his phone, cut it on. His ex. Is on the, on the mirror of the, yeah. uh, on the TV He done went to sleep and forgot to cut it off. Okay, so let me... Because I'm not quite as technologically advanced as some people. <laughs> so when you say the phone mirrors the TV, Yes, you can hit a button on there, and whatever's on your phone, you can watch it on your TV. Oh, when you have you know, it's TV. like the TV in our bedroom, and I can do I that with my phone. I don't pay attention to what you're doing with the TV. <laughs> <laughs> so whatever he's doing on his phone shows up on the TV. Right. I submit it to the court. Now tell me you ain't seen that one. You ain't do that. That's right there. Proof okay. in the pudding, baby. So this was in your... This was in Mr. Weiss's phone. Right. And now, this who's is the what private you... detective? And this is, and you found this after you saw the ex's picture up on the on your television. Yes. You go to the phone and pull it up, and this is what you found. That's right. And so Mr. Weiss writes, <laughs> love you, and then again writes, love you. And the ex says, right back at you. And then Mr. Weiss wants to know, do you love me? Mm-hmm. Uh, look at this. Nothing says Christmas like writing your ex December 25th at 1230. You wrote this on Christmas Day? I don't even remember. See? <laughs> Amnesia! Well, really, really, okay, yeah. okay, wait, 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 wait. <laughs> Have you sent your ex any text messages saying I love you? That's the question. 
Whether you, whether it was December 25th or May 25th. I don't remember. You're over here fuming right Ooh, now. Oh, yeah, I see that. She's have you found anything vibrating. else? Have you found anything else that makes you think he's cheating? <laughs> oh, yes. What Talk else have you it. found? Well, one day I was putting some clothes in the drawer and I happened to move stuff around. Sexual enhanced pills. You saw sexual enhancement pills? Yes. In the drawer? Right. The first time <laughs> I saw it, I didn't say nothing. I said, I'm gonna catch him. So I went back in the drawer, put some more stuff in. One pack missing, two pills in a pack. Well, wait, hold on. Hold, hold on. on. When you first saw the pills... Oh, I didn't tell him about it. But, but why did you just assume that he was using with someone else? I mean, you he all sure are together. sure don't need them for us. <laughs> so you don't... We've had sex, and the pills were still in that drawer because I checked the same day. All right, all right. Mr. Weiss. Yeah. How about... <laughs> please remember... Well, when she put them in the drawer... <laughs> He put them in the drawer. Okay. It, it was energy pills. It won't, it won't no Viagra, it won't nothing else. It was the, the energy pill where you buy off the shelf. So you're saying they weren't sexual hands, but they were energy pills. They was energy pills. And you did buy some energy pills. Yes. You didn't buy sexual enhancement pills. No, I don't need that. And so you... <laughs> so how did she get them? Oh, wait a minute. I don't yeah. need that. Yeah. Look, he ain't that old. Yeah, all right. <laughs> I don't know, baby. Okay, so... I'm gonna ask the hard question. Did you use those pills to be with another woman? No, I did not, Your Honor. That's what you're telling this court? Yes. And that's what you're telling Ms. Lewis? And that's what I'm telling her. All right, I think we got to know. What we have here is he's talking in sleep about big booties and exes. Mm -hmm. <laughs> he's got it. We got an I love you text, and he said, I don't remember. And then we got these sexual slash energy pills that Ms. Lewis found. And he says, the only thing I'm doing is fishing. The question is, what kind of fish is he doing? Fish or women? And where is he fishing? <laughs> and where is he fishing? Miss Lewis has said, I'm done. I am too old for this foolishness. So if it comes back that he's cheating, I think she's gone. And we're about to find out because this court has done a full and complete investigation. We're going to call it this time certified polygraph examiner Kendall Show to determine is he cheating? Bob, please report to Kendall Shoal. Mr. Shoal, how are you today? I'm great, Your Honor. How are you? I'm doing good. Would you state for the court your credentials, please? I uh, spent almost 30 years with the FBI. I uh, spent my whole career in Washington, D.C. When I retired, I was actually chief of the entire FBI's polygraph program. And uh, when I retired, I moved to Knoxville, Tennessee, began my own practice of PI and polygraph, and uh, I've done that now for almost 20 years. Now, you conducted a polygraph examination of Mr. Weiss, correct? I did, Your Honor. You asked Mr. Weiss, since the start of your relationship with Ms. Lewis, have you used sexual energy pills with anyone other than Ms. Lewis? What was his response to that question? He said no, Your Honor. What did the lie detector determine? The lie detector determined that he was being... deceptive, Your Honor. Mr. Weiss, first of all, let's clear it up. So is this one of those things you just don't remember? Because mm -hmm. you didn't remember uh, I, I, uh, telling your ex on Christmas Day that you loved her. I never used that, the, the peers with nobody else. Ms. Lewis, mm -hmm. you, you, you look like you're holding yourself up. Mm-hmm. I tried to show this man how much I love him. I took more crap off of him than I did any one of my ex-husbands. All right, let's find out about this question. Mr. Shul, you asked Mr. Weish, since the start of your relationship with Miss Lewis, other than the one time she knows about, have you had sexual intercourse with anyone other than Miss Lewis? What was his response? He said no, Your Honor. What did the lie detector determine? The lie detector determined that he was being deceptive, Your Honor. Oh, hell no. Excuse me. So, so Mr. Weiss, let's, let's do it this way. It's time to come clean now. It's time to just cards on the table. I had never cheated on her or slept with another woman since the one she know about. Because I don't have time for that. 
I love this woman. I can't keep being hurt and lied to. All I ask is being honest. Why is it so hard for you to be faithful to me As when I, I am again, faithful to you? What am I doing when, you, when I'm talking to you 24-7 or working? I mean, I can't discount the lie detector results. We've got a recognized expert in Mr. Scholl. Right. So there's something going on there. Whether you define sexual activity different than the way she defines it, because she's saying if it's in your mind, if you're thinking about it, if you're texting someone, if you're talking on the phone, in her mind, that's cheating. In your mind, it might not be cheating. Talk to our counselor, and as we say in this courtroom, don't cheat yourself out of a chance for a happy, healthy, trusting relationship. Court is adjourned.